today I'm having something that I haven't had in a hot minute I'm telling you since the mid 90s churches fried chicken I figured since I'm on a chicken kick lately I might as well give them a try being as they're actually in the Las Vegas area oops I have my coldest showing over here try and get that sucker in the frame <laughs> Yep, call this water bottle, y'all. Uh, you can get one. Link down in the description if you want it. Keeps your water cold for days. And uh, I'm working on my plate here. Have some gooey mac and cheese. I had to wait to serve that up because it was just, just so cheesy. I was like, oh man. Oh, oh I had to try that. I don't even remember what churches taste like, you guys. It's been so long. But, uh, let me finish serving up here. I got their jalapeno peppers, which they're little jalapeno pop pepper poppers, I guess. I was expecting actual jalapeno peppers, but who knows. That's how it happened. Uh, and I got fried okra. Mmm, because that's, that's southern. I got the corn on the cob, because I had to try the corn on the cob. And, of course, mashed potatoes and gravy, because, man, I am a tater girl. Oh, and that gravy smells nice and spicy, too. Oh, okay. It's a bunch of food, you guys. Mm. And I got their spicy chicken legs and thighs. And I'm looking forward to digging into that. Oh, I got coleslaw too. I got a little bitty baby thing of coleslaw. <laughs> Let me put that over here. And I got their honey butter biscuits and an apple pie too. Uh, first things first, I'm gonna I'm gonna try out their chicken. Let me get me a thigh. Oh, it looks nice and crispy. Crispy. Smells good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh man. <laughs> Mm. Oh. Mm. Wow. Okay. I don't think I've given churches a chance in a while, so I kind of forgot that they were actually really good. Mmm. cheese that looks really good and a nice little cheesy crust on top too mmm oh that's good and some mashed potatoes mmm get their gravy Oh, that's nice. I like it. Mmm, more chicken. Mmm. Mmm. Okay, I'm happy. Mmm. Man, that makes it so difficult. And there's so many chicken places in the running for best chicken. And I think churches is a contender. Mmm. 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 
Man, I'm getting Jolly Bee vibes on that. Mmm. 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 Okay. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> Let me put my phone on vibrate. <clears throat> Come here, little phone. No, I'm not answering that text right now. I'll get to you later, mister. <laughs> Hi, Frank. <laughs> And their potatoes are nice and spicy too. It's either either the potatoes are a little spicy or I'm still spicing out from the spice on the chicken crust, but I think their gravy has a light little bit of spice to it. Mm. Mm. Grease just dripped down my chin. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. I'm bite of this biscuit. Mmm. Mmm. Oh man, those are good. always said Popeyes had the best biscuits. Mmm. Mm. Can y'all see the confusion on my face? I'm a little confused here. How did I not remember that church's chicken is really, really good? Mmm. Mmm. Some of this okra. Mmm. Nice. Mmm. 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 The heck, there's a big chunk in my. My coleslaw. What is that? <laughs> I'm gonna eat it though. Mm. And some of the cabbage core. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Mmm. It's very, very similar to KFC. Mm. They don't give you a whole lot, though. Mm. 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 Mm.
Mm. Oh, I just love how the corn on the cob always squirts when I eat it. It's like, it's so juicy. Mm. 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 Fresh napkin. Mm. And your poppers are just loaded with cheese. Mmm. Oh my god. Mmm. 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 Those were the only jalapenos they had mm. on their menu. Huh. Yeah, I know they used to have the. It looked like whole jalapeno peppers that were like pickled and people would squeeze it over their chicken it was on the menu that I looked at online but obviously this churches just didn't have it so. um <clears throat> yeah and the the menu online also said you got two large sides with the tempies but apparently <laughs> they need to rework their menu online or something but I am so happy. Oh, that pepper was spicy. Oh, it hit me in the back of the throat. Oh, hot but good. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Oh my God. Mmm. Mm. Mm. I honestly think they're spicy. It's just a little bit spicier than Jolly Bee or Popeyes. That's not a bad thing, though. I mean, it's not super hot, but it's got a kick, all right. Mmm. Mmm, man. Mmm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. I'm about to have to change my favorite food to fried chicken. <laughs> you haven't had a ribeye in a while. That's true. That is true. It's been about two years since I've had a good, good ribeye. Good or any? <laughs> Good. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if... I think I had prime rib once. And I have other steaks, but... <clears throat> I like my ribeyes grilled, if possible. Mmm. 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 <laughs> Mm -hmm. I have to say their chicken is just as juicy as Jolly Bee. Mm. No joke, man. I don't know. <clears throat> mm.
Mm. <clears throat> yeah, I've been wanting to do a a ribeye dinner. I just haven't had time. And there's just so many other things that keep <laughs> that keep like getting in the way. I'm like, yeah, I want this. I want this. I want this. <laughs> mm. So many awesome food choices. Mm. Love it, their mac and cheese. It's really, really good. Mm. A nice crusty piece there. Mm. Where the cheese got all brown. Mm. Oh man. Okay, I haven't been able to talk about anything but the food because the food is like knocking me out. Excuse the crumb <laughs> duty. <laughs> mm. Oh, but uh, oh. Okay, what's on the TV? <laughs> or in my case, the laptop, because you know I watch a lot of streaming channels, but uh. Lately, excuse me, my roommate and I have been watching Love Island and that little dose of reality TV therapy. And um, they didn't have the US version on Hulu, but they have Australia and UK. So we started out with the Australia version and it is so cute, y'all. That's a good show. <laughs> mm. Mm. If you're into dating and romance reality, that is. Mm. Mm. <clears throat> I'm into betting. And what? Betting. Remember, I told you I bet none of them stay together after the show. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's <laughs> true. I was wrong. One couple. We're wrong. Just one. Spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> One couple made it. <laughs> but, uh, so we're on second season now, so. Mm. We'll see how that pans out. Mm, my nose is running just a little bit. Sorry, y'all. Mm. Um, what else is happening? Y'all know I've been watching the show Legendary on uh, HBO Max. Mm. So I was really getting interested in this ballroom stuff, this, this dancing. They're like uh, balls, basically. And we have different categories and stuff. And people dress up and they dance and, and got all that vogue in. And it's so full of energy. It's awesome. And, um... I found another show in the meantime on Netflix called Pose and that basically is about the same thing but it's a series and uh, so far I'm, I'm several episodes in and I really like it mm. 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 Watched a cute movie the other day mm. with uh, that Batista fella. 
you know, he used to be a wrestler. I don't know if he still wrestles or not. I don't, I don't think so. He'd been doing a lot of movies, though. But the movie was called My Spy. And these two CIA agents are um, watching a single mother and her daughter, you know, protecting them and stuff. And yeah. It gets, it gets fun. It's crazy. <laughs> but it's really cute. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Mm, good chicken. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Crumbs in my hair. <laughs> Crumbs drive me crazy, you guys. <clears throat> Mm. Mm. Everybody's been doing good lately. Oh, man. We've been doing fine here. <laughs> it's one day at a time. Mm -hmm. It's all anybody can do. Now, we're pretty much back in quarantine for the time being. Yeah. We've been fighting like cats and dogs. I huh? mean, fighting with the cats and dogs. Oh, we have been fighting with the cats and dogs, that's for sure. <laughs> mm. Oh, mercy. Mm. And they should have given me some butter packets. Dang it. Mm. It was good by itself, though. Mm. I guess I'm spoiled because we've been eating the um our sweet corn lately with the well Mexican style with the mayo and the Parmesan cheese. I don't have any chili powder though, so it's missing that to be authentically the Mexican corn. I don't know how to pronounce the word. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try. Well, I call it Mexican corn. Mm. So plain corn is like as sweet as good, but it's just missing something now. Mm. <clears throat> mm. 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 Oh man, that's so good. 
Mm. Well, I had to try their fried okra. Mm. Not super pleased with it. It's very, very bland. <clears throat> but, um, I mean, it's good. It's okra. <laughs> I like okra. So you'd think they'd have a little bit more spice in the breading. Mm. Mm. Maybe. Mm. 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 Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh man. Okay. Woo. Mm. <clears throat> Slowing down already. Ooh, that spice is starting to get to me. Oh, mercy. Mm, I some chicken leftovers. Yes, indeed. I do that on purpose. <laughs> Leftovers are my favorite. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh, man. One, two, three, four, five, six pieces. I got ten pieces. They didn't have an eight piece option. At least not on the menu I was looking at. Still wouldn't be eating a whole eight piece, but all right. Wasn't there a challenge for twenty of those? Of them? Yeah, twenty. Yeah, yeah. I don't think I won't be. I won't be finishing that challenge, but I could at least try it. <laughs> yeah, the twenty chicken leg challenge. Yeah, I'm gonna give that a go at some point. It's getting kind of old though. That challenge has been out for a little while. Hmm. <clears throat> Mm. Oh, y'all, excuse me. Mm. I don't want to bite it. And my belly saying, stop. Okay, 
Okay, if I bite it, I'm gonna keep it on my plate and eat it in a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna bite it. Mmm. Mmm. Mark my territory. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's all she wrote for me. Oh, wait a minute. And a couple more bites of this coleslaw. And then I'm gonna eat my pie. Mm. 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 Okay. So where does church is right now that I've had it? Oh man. That's tough. Hmm. Another apple pie. Oh. <clears throat> they put frosting on their pies. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> this might tell the tale. So I don't know. They might might have already beat Popeyes. And how does that happen? How does that even happen? But uh, I'm not too sure if they beat Jollibee yet. Man, that chicken is good though. Okay. Mmm. 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 Ooh. Mmm. Mmm. <clears throat> I don't know, man. <clears throat> I think uh, KFC, Popeyes. It's it's a toss up between churches and Jollibee now. Mm. Mm. Dang churches. <clears throat> you know what for a chicken place? I mean, cause Jollibee's got the spaghetti and the spaghetti's great, but Straight up chicken place. I think churches might have to win. Oh, I got a handful of pie filling. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna leftover food shame you and say, the Jolly Bee spaghetti's still in the fridge. It sure is. There's still a serving of Jolly Bee spaghetti in the fridge. Mm. But to be fair, we've been having a lot of really good food lately. <clears throat> a lot of home cooked food, actually. Mm. Your pasta bake is awesome. Yeah, if y'all want to see some of that pasta bake, I put little short videos on uh, Instagram. Yeah, I made that the other night. <laughs> was it last night? <laughs> I don't think there's much of that left. Um, but yeah, it was a creamy chicken pasta bake. And it was cheesy, creamy, and had all kinds of vegetables in it. And it came out really good. I was really proud of it. But, yeah, go check out my Instagram. It's uh, hungry underscore fat chick. I compared it to Olive Garden. It really was that good. I appreciate that. <laughs> it had enough butter and, and half and half in it. I didn't use whole cream, but I could have used, used cream. And that would have just kicked it up another notch, even. But, uh, I'm gonna buy this biscuit. Mm. But, yeah, I'll put the recipe on there. 
for anybody that wants to try and make it. And I followed absolutely no recipe. I did that all out of my brain. <clears throat> and it's like, casseroles are easy. It's an easy meal choice for people. I've only known you for a couple of years, but I swear you probably got fat because your cooking was so damn good when you were younger. <laughs> I did. I did. I was in my first year of marriage, from 18 to 19, I gained 100 pounds. Because I was cooking at home. I was, was like, oh, I'm cooking for my husband. It's like, no, you was cooking for you, fatty. <laughs> mm. Your etouffee was really good, too. Yeah, I made a crawfish etouffee. Y'all will see that video coming up in a couple of weeks. But, uh, yeah, I made etouffee. And um, I think a zucchini tomato casserole. And my roomie made um, a nice veggie casserole. So, yeah, I've got all the all the uh recipes lined up for y'all too so yeah i've been been in the kitchen it's really hard in there though <laughs> i posted a picture <clears throat> in the crawfish etouffee video where y'all can see what i look like when i come out of the kitchen and that's probably one of the reasons i don't mukbang a lot of my home cooking because you know, I look like a drowned rat, I swear. <laughs> like everything was <laughs> melted. Everything was melted. And my hair was all soaking wet. And I'm like, help. <laughs> you really did look like a drowned rat that day. I did. I really did. Thank goodness I went and fixed myself back up. So I actually looked presentable for the video. But, man, it was, it was hard to believe I could save that look. <laughs> and I put makeup on and everything before I went in the kitchen to cook. Don't do that. <laughs> and next time I need to put my hair up in a ponytail or something before I cook. Because my hair was just soaking wet. And it's not even that hot in the kitchen. It's just over there by the stove. It just, the, it, the heat just kind of radiates. And I mean, y'all that do cooking in the kitchen, y'all know what I'm talking about. It gets hot in there. Mm. This is how good this woman's cooking is. My best friend <laughs> blackmailed her. <laughs> into making her jambalaya <laughs> two pans to take home yeah and my friend was like i'm gonna eat this for the next two weeks and she mm -hmm. wouldn't she wouldn't bring jolly bees unless <laughs> candy did that no no it was uh that was for the indian food oh the indian food yeah i was uh, i got an indian food video coming up soon i hadn't had indian food in quite a while because it's there, there's no places close and no places that deliver so you know she goes to that area <laughs> often so she passed by over there and picked it up for me which was very nice of her um yeah Catherine over at cork space station if y'all want to check her out but uh yeah she got four pounds of jambalaya out of that deal <laughs> but i got a, just everything on the menu at india palace that i really love so and i had leftovers for a really long time i, I think Two weeks later, I still had some of the basmati rice left. <laughs> we had some of that with the, with the uh, etouffee uh, leftovers the next couple of days. But, uh, oh yeah. So, I'm, I'm remembering my love of cooking. Just fun. <laughs> I just remember she blackmailed me into making two green bean casseroles <laughs> for the Jollibees. <clears throat> yeah, the, yeah, the Jollibees got, she got... Uh, green bean casserole she don't cook she, she don't want to cook she don't want to cook she's like if i can get somebody to cook for me <laughs> right on love you bestie yeah we sure do. <laughs> <clears throat> but hey you know i've always i'm always the kind of person you know food prepared for me is always better than food i cook myself you know and i say that but then i cook and i'm like oh yeah that's really good I just wish I had the energy to eat it after I finished cooking. But, uh, yeah, I, I prefer other people to cook, to be honest. <laughs> but, uh, oh, man. Okay, so I got really, really full on chicken and sides. And and I'm going to finish my plate over the next hour, probably. I'm going to slow way down. And I'm going to put my leftovers, which I got some leftover mashed potatoes, leftover macaroni. I'm going to finish that coleslaw but i'm gonna put my biscuits away with my chicken too but uh oh god that was fun <laughs> and yeah i think churches might have kept jollybee's butt i'm sorry jollybee 
Church has really surprised me here. Well, that's good because it's easier to get to the church's <laughs> chicken than Dolly Yeah, it really is. Dolly Bees is kind of far away. Oh, my goodness. And they're kind of a pain in the butt to order from on, on the phone. <laughs> yeah, it just, it didn't, none of, none of it worked out. So I had to pay in person. But, um, oh, man. So, yeah, I had a good time. And uh, if, if y'all like, uh, the ballroom community, the ballroom scene, uh, uh, it's, it's very interesting. I, I love that dance. I love watching people dance. You know, it's just like, man, you know, even if I was small, I don't think I could move like that. I just, I just ain't got it in me. <laughs> but, uh, I love you guys very much, and I thank you for joining me, and I will see you next time. Wait, wait, wait. I'm going to interrupt one more time. I want to know, what's your favorite merch? My. You've got merch out now. What's oh, your favorite one? My favorite merch? Yep. Which oh, one? That's hard. I think the first thing I'm going to buy, I actually buy. <clears throat> I mean, they might give me a little discount, but who knows? I ain't tried to buy any of it yet. But uh, I happen to like the Always Hungry t-shirt. I want an Always Hungry tank. Because even though I'm not always hungry, it's just, it looks good. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I'm like, oh, he's hungry. <laughs> oh, man. I might redesign those at some point, too. I don't know. I got a couple of them that I kind of want to redesign. But um, I'm getting new ideas all the time. So I'm going to put new stuff up there. Yeah, it's a Hungry Fat merch. Uh, they got, you know, uh, a link to some of the items. Uh under the description i think um a link to the store in the description and uh yeah it's teespring and i made sure to only uh get the shirt designs that go up to like a 5x and they're unisex too so you know men's women's whatever you know uh but i, I haven't seen if i could fit them yet so i'm, I'm very curious to see <laughs> i need a six or seven x <laughs> Yeah, I probably do too, to be honest. <laughs> but they, they didn't make them that big. But the, the 5X does say it goes up to like a 32. So we'll see. We'll see. Whew. All right, y'all. <laughs> I love you. And I'll see you next time. Bye now. <laughs>